I'd like you to join me in my new uh, campaign, which is just say no to turnovers. Okay, say thank you. I mean, you. <laughs> it worked for Charles Barkley when he swore off eating, right, until the uh, Lakers won. And I say no more turnovers until the Warriors stop this. Okay, so you're stealing the Steph Tur uh, Curry yes. little tweet there, huh? Yes. Well, he put the tweet up with the turnovers and said, you know, let's got to change. Yeah. It didn't change, and the Spurs feasted on him. Must have killed you last night watching oh, that game with oh. the Warriors not handling the ball well. The pain. I can't even <laughs> begin to tell you. I love you. You're terrific. <laughs> well, didn't watch one second of the game, no, but you're upset. Not a second. You know what I loved? I actually, I didn't watch the game. I did read the quotes. I loved uh, uh, the coach, Steve Kerr's quote about, hey, I hung it up 12 years ago, right? And yeah. these guys, the same players, Parker, uh, uh, Ginobili, Duncan, Popovich, they're all there. Yeah, that really, that was a good one, too. I, when, I, when I heard him say it, is that now he's moved on, he's a coach, yeah. and the same guys that he said, geez, I'm getting too tired to play, they're still rolling. Yeah, and by the way, then he went on to say, I wish they'd just go away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no such luck. A, he's, he's, listen, I, I enjoyed Kerr after a loss. No, I, that's when you find out, you know, yeah. what a guy's about, and he handled himself well. But True. San Antonio just better. That's just, you know, well, I, I, I got to admit, I'm watching the game, and I'm saying, yeah, these guys have all been playing a long time, but yeah. they, they they just know each other's moves so well. It's the second nature. Still as fresh and hot as a nice apple turnover. Okay, we stop with that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what about let's let's talk some serious stuff about the 49ers because I don't know how serious this is. When you got Patrick Willis out for the whole season with the toe, is that I mean is that gonna like really jam up to to think about a jam toe the 49ers playoff hopes? Yeah. Well, just look I, at his resume. He'd been in the league seven years. Yeah. All seven times he was selected to the Pro Bowl. Of course, it won't be this year. But, uh, hey, what you're going to lose with uh, with Willis, that Alden Smith is coming back with fresh legs right. ready to go. Right. So, uh, I don't want to say they'll cancel out each other, but it's sure better to have uh, one instead of have uh, both out. And you know how these fans are, and I call them these those fans, right? It's always like you feel somehow better, like if we're suffering and our rivals are suffering, and it's worse for the Seahawks because the guy they lost on Sunday, we don't know for how long, uh, this Brandon Mebane, uh, he could be out for a while, and they don't have somebody else coming in like 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 Alden Smith or, or Bowman, you know? You know, I, as much as I, I think you're the greatest, when you stump me with Brandon oh, Mebane, really? you know, what he, am I supposed to say? He's you know very, more than I do on this. He's very important to the team. And so it's a good loss for us is the way I'd like to look at it. I, Daria, I don't know where how you were raised, but well, I was always like yes. when we're competing against other stations, yes. if we're having a, you know some bad shows or yes. some ba bad run of luck, that's fine. Hopefully the other stations do well. Really? Really? Yeah. I, I like it when my opponents eat crow, and the Seahawks are eating crow. Their actual hawk is eating crow. I'm Just never eat. happy when me brain is hurt. <laughs> no, the Seahawks, the hawk is actually apologizing also in that game on Sunday. Yes. Did you see him land on the fan's head? <laughs> no, it, so he, I'll show it to you again, too, and it looks like it hurts. You know, it's got the talons. He veered off. He lands on this guy's head. Then he went onto the shoulder in front. So honestly, it has a Twitter page. And the Hawk says, I apologize to fellow birds and my family and everywhere. Uh, I'm embarrassed by the pregame incident and the poor judgment I showed. And he goes on. He says, please understand they were inconsistent, these actions, with the type of bird I have wanted to be become go me's get yeah. it Seahawks hey, go no, me what's cute though is that you see that guy petted him I, I, you know, if somebody went on my head I'd be swinging like hey get away from me no kidding this guy was real sweet about it yeah and you know that's gotta hurt and but see and, and it does hurt and it hurts me to see the Seahawks pained in this way oh, I take a little gosh. joy from it where did you come up with me brain a little boy what did, where did I come up because I was reading up on I like to see it when we're suffering how the Seahawks are doing it's and a I terrible just, way to live you know I'm not kidding you and by the way I like the coach's uh, a quote on me brain he says he has a really legit hamstring pull like we were questioning was it legit or not oh, so geez. it was weird <laughs> okay why does Tom Brady go to bed at 8 30 every night as well he doesn't have to get up at three like we do you know why why to get away from Giselle no, talking he's gone <laughs> I, I, you don't believe me when I tell you this a beautiful woman like that and and always talking and giving her opinion and that's not a sexist ain't the same thing with a man if you've got a man who's dominating and talking all the time i want to go to bed oh 
man. You know what? The guys, by the way, said if Giselle was waiting in bed, I'd go to bed immediately oh, as soon the, as possible. Sorry, we just, just stop with all this stuff. Unless you live with somebody, you have no idea right, what they're like. Here's what he, anyway, Tom says it's because he takes the job seriously, like eating, drinking, sleeping. It's all part of his job. He takes it seriously, as does Giselle, who, again, remember Giselle multitasking? Remember the famous shot she put up on, uh, t tweeted the picture of her breastfeeding, you know, with a, with a, with a modeling career around her? What is this? Someone take this baby. And, <laughs> <laughs> Daria, now, are you done? I don't know what that accent is. Look who's doing it now. Yeah. Can, Look can who's I hanging out. Explain to you one more time. Do not, do you not start in on Giselle. At night means I've I heard enough. Let me out of here. <laughs> That's what it means. I'm going upstairs, please. What do you think? What do you think about it? What do you, this is the new thing. Now Giselle started it, and this is Alyssa Milano. She's got a newborn too. She's like back to work, and she tweets a shot. All right, that doesn't bother me. No. You know something? I have the right not to look at it. You do have the. Or some people, like I used to put the thing, like you know, you could use anything—a napkin, a blanket, a shawl. Yeah. Uh, but not these days, Gare. Not well, these days. Well, I mean, let's face it. If you're in the showing off business, yes. There's a tendency to say, hey, I, I'm going to get some attention by doing this. It, I mean, I, yeah. you know, if you're a carpenter, <laughs> I probably wouldn't show it, but no. if you're in show business and you show up, would you do it? I, no, no, see, that's the thing. I like, and I'm pretty open about this, but I'm like, I'm just a big fan of, I don't want to not do it in public, but I put the you know, the thing over. Because it's like a little tent, you know? And then, uh, I don't know. Somebody else is going to tweet this picture out if, you know, if they didn't. I, I'm not comfortable all with right, that. All right, all no? right. And I'll, and I'll say it again. Do we yes. have to look at it? Do I, no, this is true. I'm all for freedom of speech, freedom <laughs> of expression. And you, freedom to go to bed at 8.30 see, if somebody's yeah. talking too much. Stop talking to me. I, I'm going to convince you on Giselle someday. All, all right. right. We'll see you here. All right, all right.